我国陆军训练司令部前美籍首席顾问欧道德七月底辞世。我驻美国华府军事代表团二号代表国防部颁赠了陆光甲种奖章，表彰欧道德对台湾国防与军事教育的贡献。So special to Paul because he was a collector of Chinese medals and had so many, but this was one that was such a highly prized medal that. He would be so honored, and I, as am I, and our son John. The last thing he talked about Taiwan was returning there to live again. And if it had been possible, we would have done so. 一九七九年台美断交之后，欧道德一家人继续留在台湾。退役后是开设了全员美语学校，教授高阶美语。直到一九八九年，因为健康因素返美，但是对台湾一直念念不忘。欧道德的遗孀欧茉莉说，在台湾的日子是他跟先生最美好的时光，对台湾的人情味，还有跟台湾友人建立的情谊最难忘怀。